Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were both close with their mothers growing up, and this should come as no surprise, because Doria Ragland had a startlingly similar parenting technique to Princess Diana, a book has revealed. Both mothers wanted to impress upon their children that not everyone is as privileged as they are, to make them more aware of the problems and suffering in the world. In 2018 book Meghan, a Hollywood princess, royal biographer Andrew Morton revealed how Diana and Doria did this. Doria took Meghan to Oaxaca, Mexico, where Meghan saw children playing in dirt roads and to the slums of Jamaica. Meanwhile, Diana took both Prince William and Prince Harry to visit the homeless and sick in London. Mr. Morton said Meghan's childhood experiences were the crucible that set her on the path to activism and that Doria played her part. He said, Doria played her own part, strict at home, but also ready to show her daughter that there was more to the world than Woodland Hills. She raised her to be what she called a global citizen, taking her to places like Oaxaca, Mexico, where Meghan recalls seeing children playing in the dirt roads and peddling chewing gum so that they could bring home a few extra pesos. When Meghan, then aged 10, and her mother visited the slums of Jamaica the schoolgirl was horrified to see such grinding poverty. Don't look scared, Flower her mother told her. Single quote be aware, but don't be afraid. He added, her experience is reminiscent of the times the late Diana, Princess of Wales, privately took her boys William and Harry to visit the homeless and sick in central London, they would hopefully appreciate that life did not begin and end at the palace gates. One of the charities Diana, William and Harry visited was the passage in 1993. Kensington Palace published a photograph of the family there and a guest book signed, William. The Duke of Cambridge even became a patron for the charity 25 years later. He said it taught him the values of respect, dignity and kindness to the vulnerable that he has carried with him ever since, according to the Telegraph. Another charity they visited was Sentry Point, to which William became a patron in 2005. He said he wanted to keep his mother's work alive. In this way, Diana and Doria made a big impression on their children by exposing them to those less fortunate than themselves. Meghan, Harry and William are now all keen activists and patrons for various charities.